at August 10, 2019 at 1.45 a.m. The super typhoon Lishima made landfall off the coast of Ling City, Zhejiang Province. The typhoon center has maximum wind speed of 16 level, about 53 meters per second. This is not only China's strongest typhoon in recent years. It is the third stronger typhoon landfall in Zhejiang since 1949. At this time, more netizens are focusing on China's tallest building. The Shanghai Central Tower is China's first super high-rise landmark skyscraper. The total height is 632 meters and the structure height is 580 meters. The building is facing a super typhoon for the first time since it was completed in 2016. Can it withstand the storm? In this regard, at August 10, a reporter conducted an interview with Shanghai Central Building. A video was released showing a slight swing in the building. But there were no other problems. As a super high-rise building, typhoon prevention is much more difficult than ordinary buildings. How did the 632-meter Shanghai Central Building withstand the typhoon? In general, in normal wind pressure stayed from the ground height of 10 meters, if the wind speed is 5 meters per second. Then at an altitude of 90 meters, the wind speed can reach 15 meters per second if the distance is 400 meters, the wind will be more powerful. At this point the building will have a wiggle present. In order to protect the building wiggle there are two main solutions. The first is to change the shape of the building, which interferes with the wind. The second is to set up a device called a wind damper in a super high-rise building that can effectively reduce the wiggle of super high-rise buildings by strong winds. The world's largest wind damper is currently located in the 101 building in Taipei, Taiwan. It is a gold sphere with a diameter of 5.5 meters and a weight of about 680 metric tons. Typhoon Sudiro made landfall in Taipei in 2015. Not only did the 101 building close for a day, the shockproof damper at the top of the building oscillates by as much as 1 meter, the highest in history. Shanghai is located along the coast, so typhoons are often hit. Therefore, at the beginning of the building construction, the corresponding typhoon prevention design was first measured by wind tunnel test. Strive to the best wind resistance. This building is built with a 120-degree rotating structure. Greatly reduce the sway ingress of the building caused by the strong winds. According to experts, Shanghai Central Building Design, with the same amount of rectangular building wind resistance reduced by 24%. It is the most wind-resistant building in the world. In addition, the core of the building is built around a cylinder. It can save a lot of engineering cost and reduce energy consumption. In addition to the exterior, the top of the building is equipped with the world's first swing electric vortex tuning mass damper. The damper consists of a sling, a mass block, a damping system, and a main structure protection system. With a total weight of more than 1,000 tons, it is the heaviest swing damper mass block in the world. By 1225 meters of steel cable dropped in the air. In addition, the damper also applied for a patent for the invention, by netizens as the town building magic. According to industry insiders, Shanghai Central Building damper since the completion of the state has not reached the limit. Typhoon Ambi made landfall in Shanghai in 2018. The building dampers start to operate, with a maximum swing of about 40 to 50 centimeters. The maximum swing amplitude of the damper can be 2 meters. The super typhoons like Like Me can easily withstand by the building, since typhoon Like Me made landfall on August 10, the wind damper in the central Shanghai building has been activated. However, at present, the swing is not large, so we have no need to worry about building safety. In addition, the initial construction of the building foundation is a pioneer. It is understood that the main building of the Shanghai Central Building has a base area of up to 61,000 cubic meters. This is currently the world's largest single building foundation pit, in order to ensure the building's low-level stability. Below that, diameter 121 meter, 6 meter thick head round rigid mud platform is poured. The total area is about 112,000 square meters, equivalent to 1.6 standard football field sizes. The thickness is two stories high. 955 piling foundations are also inserted under the concrete platform, to gather load of the 121-floor Shanghai Central Building. As described as the Dingai Gods by the image of the construction workers. In recent years, there have been more and more super projects made in China. These projects are a great test every time a major disaster strikes. Last year, the Hong Kong Zhuhai Macau Bridge was hit by a level 16 typhoon shortly after it opened and broke the world's doubts about the Hong Kong Zhuhai Macau Bridge. This year's super typhoon is the test of China's tallest building. In this way, 
the Level 16 Super Typhoon will not have any impact on the central building in Shanghai. If you like this video please subscribe us. We will continue to present you with great China achievements.